Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I am of the stars. We're in the midst of the Lion's Gate in early August 2016 and I have some investigative reporting about the clearings that are taking place. Two that I know of. Um, in one case it's someone that I know through Claire Chat and they went through the uh, disentanglement of um, soul wounding that had occurred to them in extremely early childhood actually in, a, in another lifetime the, the incarnation prior and also in their own early childhood and that all got disentangled and filled with light for them and their clear chatter is completely different now there's no more of that soul wounding in it so the biggest job of their um, soul clearing has been done during this lion's gate. That's the first instance. And the second instance that I have to talk about has to do with, with something I experienced yesterday, uh, which was incredible. I've been very, very sleepy during the daytime uh, during the lion's gate. And so clearing work is taking place even when I'm asleep. I'm sure of that. So I was, I was just lying on my back yesterday during the afternoon after exercising in the morning and what happened is not within my experience in this lifetime or any time that I can remember. It was as if a very dense, dark, um, kind of gray-black cloud of energy lifted away from my left side, right? It lifted away from my left side I didn't recognize it as my own. It was that very different from what I know myself to be. Uh, and uh, at first I thought perhaps it was malevolent, perhaps it was an entity. I just didn't know what to think. But as I observed, I didn't get any sense of personality from it. Only that the, this very dark, dense energy from my left side was like a cloud, like a black cinder cloud of smoke, dense smoke, was lifting off. It, it had a particular particulate nature to it, like it was made up of tiny, tiny, tiny little granules of something. So it lifted off, and just as it was lifting away from my left hip, I started to hear from someone else on the Claire plane the lifting of uh, extremely angry, like, repressed emotion of rage. It sounded like a five-year-old girl was just, you know, having a tantrum, having an extreme tantrum about something. It wasn't me, you know, but at the same time, it had, that energy had somehow attached to me in past because there was a, like a brokenness in my energy field there at my left hip. Uh, which expresses itself in this lifetime as repeated um, uh, accidents in that area or tension or like um, just aches in that area. And, and, and this is typical of soul wounding uh, in general that is clearing right now. If you have aches and pains or repeated injuries in a particular area, you can be certain this expresses soul wounding from prior lifetimes that is accumulated and expressed itself physically in this lifetime. And that would be a reason to pay particular attention to that area physically, to stretch it and uh, to, to nourish it and send it good thoughts and so forth. It'll help the healing. So then after this extremely peculiar experience of the Lion's Gate energy, Yesterday, right after that, after the black cloud lifted from my left side and, the, and the, the tantrum, you know, that had been stored in my left hip that just gravitated there because of the in injury there, it gravitated from somebody else and stored itself and then released itself as a, as a black cloud went away. I asked everybody I could reach on the Clara plane, I said, did anything just happen to you? Did anything just happen to you like that? And some of them said that they had felt uh, the same kind of cloud lift from their right side. And some of them said they had felt that very sort of cloud lift from their left side. 
I don't know what to say, but that's my report on the Lion's Gate so far. I wish you very good luck in pursuing your clearing through the end of the Lion's Gate. This is energy of the stars coming through to us. It's the energy of the far distant galaxies that is able to come through during the Lion's Gate and, and, and repair and heal uh, all humankind and Earth, Earth herself.